it's it's all set um so as you know we're gonna paint this uh we need a prussian blue color or uh, uh, uh basically uh, you know prussian blue is like dark blue color so uh, we'll add some black with it but i guess this is the like perfect blue for this uh water thing then uh some green color and uh white uh, obviously titanium white for the this white portion and uh, so yeah i have some uh, round brushes with me and for this uh, like starry thing i have like pen or uh, we can also use a brush to sprinkle that white color okay so this is my zen sangam black sketchbook i'll be uh, painting on this one so yeah okay so i hope everybody is ready if you don't have these uh, particular materials you can uh, watch it and learn it and after that uh, after that you can try this painting and others if you are if you want to follow me along you can and please feel free to ask any query or any doubt you are having i hope i'll answer that yeah so first of all we have to make this circle uh, you know to obviously to paint our earth so i'll take my compass and and sorry for this noise as uh, there's some construction going on in my house So yeah, I've drawn my circle, and uh, now first, uh, we'll uh, draw. Uh, we'll. It's not like that. First, uh, you know, together we're gonna draw these uh, pieces, like everything. First, we'll do blue color, and then you know. Actually, uh, actually, the bigger uh, portion is of blue. So first, we're gonna do blue. Then we'll come to green, and then uh, we'll do white color. So I'm gonna take my Prussian blue color. I'm taking eight number brush, a round brush. I'll just dip in the water. that's enough we'll also have some black color uh black color uh, why i'm using black color because see here i hope you all can see here we have some like lighter blue and there is dark like darker blue so we'll mix black and uh, prussian blue to make it like darker blue and here also some darker blue but other it is like lighter one so yeah that's why we are using black color mm -hmm. i've mixed bit water because it's very thick color so i'll take a pinch of black and i'll mix it with my prussian blue like slowly slowly i leave this space like you can see uh I'm leaving the space for the white color
and here we have like a green portion. So I'll draw a bit of this. So yeah, darker blue here. And here we'll leave space for white. And now lighter blue. So I'll take my white color. And we'll blend it with our last color, which was a uh, darker blue. We should be like more dark in the color so i'll take more black here Now we can uh, paint on our line, uh, on our circle, because it's not white here. It is, but it's very little. Again, more darker here. Mostly here is a white color, so uh, we'll leave this here only. If uh, blue will be uh, needed, we'll use it afterwards. We'll paint uh, here afterwards. Now we'll move here. It is like lighter blue only. Then again, darker blue. A little, uh, you know, blending is required, not much. Here we are having uh, like a green land. So let's move to the right side.
here we have DACO one. More dark. Let's just make a outline for the green land so that we can have an idea. Now here, here it was like darker, so mix black with blue. It's like very, very light here. Okay, so our uh, blue color, like mostly uh, the blue color on the earth is uh, done. Uh, we'll use blue color afterwards also, you know, to give some highlights. Now we can move to our green color. Yeah. I'm just gonna wash my brush. So I have a uh, sap green color. I'll mix it with a uh, yellow color. Because it's lighter green, not proper like green color.
Oops. This is yellow octree color. Like, as you can see, it's like lighter green. And also we have some little yellow color here also. So for that, uh, we'll not paint like darker green, it's lighter only. Here we have a green land. First, we'll draw the outline and then we'll paint dinner. This is a Viridian uh, green, which, have, uh, which I'll use uh, for uh, making this green land. So yeah, highlight is, uh, sorry, outline is done. Now we'll paint inside. I'll use our Viridian green color. First, let's paint and then we'll add yellow. We'll not use our much force to, you know, on our brush to paint. Just use your light hands. Just dab on this one.
Now we'll move to the bottom. We have some here also. I've used a bit black here because it's a bit darker. So that's why. But yellowish here. Here also, it's dark. Sorry. <clears throat> It's darker here, so I'll use it black.
bit yellow here. Uh, so green part is also done. Uh, now we'll move to a uh, white portion. So let's clean the brush. We'll start from here. You will give some uh, cloudy effect. Don't put much pressure on the brush. And then we'll go downwards. Also, here also some cloudy effect. We have some uh, blue on this portion. So first we'll do white and then we'll give some blue highlights. Uh, don't use a uh, white again and again on uh, you know on your brush first uh, like i have taken this amount first i'll use this whole uh, portion on my brush and then again uh, i'll take my white color because uh, he, we have some you know cloudy effects for that we don't need much white color so with light hands One line here also. And then we have these some lines here also. Some are lighter and some are darker. Here also, it is like cloud effect only, not much white. You can use blue also. Here also, I use some blue color with light hands. Uh, 
don't put much force on your brush okay some white Just clean your uh, brush and then do this for lighter, lighter, you know, cloudy effect. Okay, so now we'll come here. Take my white paint. Some crisscross doesn't have that particular, you know, shape. I use blue on these ones. It's not much white, blue is also there. So again, your white color. So my brush will use finish this week. A bit darker and these like V shape is uh, lighter and this also, but here some lines on this thing. We left uh, this space, like as you can see, we have not painted on this one. So we'll paint like white color on this one. First we'll draw an outline and then we'll paint. It's not like a proper white color. We'll mix some blue color with this one. Yeah, first we'll give some cloudy effect. Now I'll use blue color. Some lines here. It 
it's not much white as I told you. Okay, so we'll move forward. Here we have a I don't have white color, but I'm using that color, which is left on my brush. So don't you don't use extra color here. Here also some cloudy effect. We'll give some blue lines on this one. From bottom, it is more thick. Now here, it's like a bit of a moon shape, not proper, but seems like. Stab your brush here for little, little like small, small dots. Around this also. Now from here. Thank you. 
it's not pure white here. Uh, we're gonna add some blue color here. Some cloud effect with light hands. So now again, uh, take your Prussian blue color, mix it with black one. As there's some space left, we're gonna fill this one. It's a bit darker, so I'm just gonna paint here. Here. We've already painted, I'm just painting it. Yeah, so now uh, we'll add some blue color over the white color. With light hands, don't uh, put much pressure because then it will be whole blue, which is not required. Little, little, yeah, here it is darker blue, so yeah, which is fine. And then again, blue here, and then here. Here also we have some blue color. Put more white here. Now cloud effect. It will look original after, you know, giving some cloudy effect and like a uh, white will just complete the whole earth in this like painting. Here also I'm gonna give some I'm gonna paint some like blue here on these lines and this also. It's more of white. don't uh you know worry for the end result just go with the process because if you'll worry now uh your painting will you know not give you the best result so just go with the flow it's okay if you know it's not like you what what you thought but uh, you know it's all we all have ups and downs so you all you have to enjoy this because uh there's no benefit of it if you're not enjoying the painting or uh, if you're doing it forcefully of course the results are not going to be the best so just go with the flow and enjoy the whole process and uh, you'll get the best result
Okay, so we're gonna get some uh, cloudy effects on uh, this green land also. So don't uh, take you know much white. Yeah. So here it is. Some have like darker white also here also. We have some white here also. Just to blue on this one. Now we'll move downwards. Here we have more white as compared to upwards. more white here. It's almost done. So now I'm gonna give some cloud effect wherever like it's required. It's very dull white, so I'm gonna paint more here. And these lines also just make some cloudy effect. Just some blue over here. Okay, uh, so now for this glow effect, as you can see this, oops, sorry, yeah. As you can, this line here, not line, you know, it's just touching the circle. So just take your titanium white color. First, let me just clean my brush. Yeah, so take your white color 
like very very less white color you can wa uh, wash it on your you know just tap it on your tissue or your cloth it's very lighter and do it here it's like more of water and less color you know this glow is about you can use like this is a four number brush you can use one also like detailing brush to avoid any problem here here also <clears throat> Give some more white here. Yellow also. Uh, now we have to you know make this like starry thing uh, you can use white uh, paint uh, sorry you can use uh, you can make it with a brush or uh, you can take toothbrush and you know just sprinkle all over the page or uh, 
I have this white gel pen. Uh, I can uh, we can make with that also. But uh, first, I'm gonna add uh, some dots over here. So, like this, like here we have March. These are very you know small one, but they have a big impact on your painting. Here also. Wait. Here, uh, I just you know forgot to give some uh, cloud effects. It's not plain. It has some cloud effect. Also, just mix your paint with Prussian blue white paint. And give a blue highlight here. Here also a bit. Okay, for this uh, style effect, I'm going to use a toothbrush because it's very easy and uh, it will not consume much time. So I'm going to step my brush in white color. Just here.
as you can see it will you know just faint but uh, you don't have to do again and again it's just to give some if effect like this Okay, so now I'll take my gel pen, white gel pen, and add some more with the stars. Like wherever you want to put, it's not compulsion. This, it is like more darker here. So yeah, our painting is done. 